The winters of my childhood were long, long seasons. We lived in three places. The school, the church, and the record store. The school was a sort of punishment. It was the most natural way for our parents to punish us. However, it was a place where we could talk about music with our friends. As for church, we found the tranquility of God. There we forgot about school and we dreamt about our favorite music. In our daydreams, we would recite a prayer. We would ask God to help us sing as good as Celine Dion. It was the winter of 1992, and Celine had just released the hit single If You Asked Me To on her new self-titled CD, Celine Dion. We all sang songs like Celine Dion. We all starved ourselves thin like Celine Dion. But more importantly, we all had crushes on our grandfathers like Celine Dion. We knew everything there was to know about Celine Dion. In our bedrooms at night when our parents were gone, we were a group of petit petit Celine Dion singing all of her greatest hits. How could we forget that? Her new record, The Color of My Love, was coming out at the same time as my birthday. So my mail did what she always did. She wrote a letter to Columbia House asking for the CD. Columbia House answered my mother's request, and in four to six weeks, I received my birthday CD, accompanied by eight others for the price of a penny. Now that day, I had one of the greatest disappointments of all my life. Instead of the beautiful singing Salamander Celine Dion, Columbia House had sent me the corny country singer, Shania Twain. Pierre Trudeau said there would be days like this. But never had anyone in my neighborhood listened to Shania Twain. With tears in my eyes, I found the strength to say, I am never listened to Shania Twain. My boy, if you make your mind up about the CD before you listen to it, you won't get very far in this world. My mother grabbed my stereo, pulled the headphones over my ears and pressed play. Now when my good friend Jacques came over for my birthday party, we snuck up to my bedroom to listen to CDs just like always. But when I put Shania Twain into the CD player, Jacques he thought I was stupid and he laughed at me out loud. Oh, 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 I'm so French. Oh. Now that laugh got me so mad, I took the CD out of the player, I crashed it against the floor. My mother heard all the commotion, she stormed up to my bedroom. I bent down to pick up the broken CD, and when I got up, my male was staring right through me. A good boy never loses his temper. Now take out my makeup and my wig, and go to church and ask God to forgive you. Holding my Shania Twain CD, I went to church, where I prayed to God. I asked God, I said, hey, listen, mon dieu, why don't you send me right away 100 million moths that would take my Shania Twain CD away? 